Hey guys, so we are currently sitting in the parking lot at Walmart because we decided we were going to get out of the house with all of the children, okay? We're gonna be brave and do some shopping and get some stuff. He's kind of like unsettled right now. I'm trying to figure out what to do with him. Some things that we've been wanting to get and we just haven't been out of the house to do so. So we're actually gonna be heading home pretty soon because Miles has a checkup today at four o'clock and it's two o'clock right now and we're like an hour away from home. So, but I did figure I would go ahead and start the vlog because I wanted to film since he's having a checkup and he's already had two checkups and I haven't filmed any of them or anything like that and so I felt kind of bad but I just nursed him and it's so crazy to me how when you get on your third kid that you like literally don't care about just like whipping your boob out and feeding your kid Josh was like where should I park aren't you gonna breastfeed like he was trying to point me like away from everything and I was like someone's gonna pull up right in front of me just because I'm nursing that's just gonna happen and honestly I don't even care we stopped and got some Duncan you guys know I never get to get Duncan because it's like I said like an hour away and they actually made my drink good this time I got an iced um, caramel latte and normally I order an iced coffee with caramel and cream but I've learned that at the Duncan here it's better just to do a caramel latte because for some reason that ends up tasting better every single time so as good mommy's happy he has been in his seat a lot today and I'm so proud of how good he has done. He literally just slept the whole time that we were, we went into Sam's Club. Um, we went to JCPenney to get Liam a little bit, like a few shirts for starting school because he's starting school next month. What are you doing, bro? Um, and he just slept the whole time. He finally woke up and he was just like really grumpy because he's really hungry because he slept for so long, but I'm not really sure if he's done nursing or not. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna check and see. Okay, I guess he wasn't done yet, but it is so, so incredibly hot outside today. It is ridiculous. Bryce is, oh, you can see him. He's just like slunched over asleep. Josh and Liam are inside of Walmart now because he promised Liam that if he was good, he would get him a new game for his Switch because Liam's been asking for a new game for his Switch for like a hot minute. So that's what they are doing and then we're gonna head to his appointment. I'm really curious to know how much he weighs. I feel like he's 11 pounds. Maybe I'm overestimating, but you know, he was like so huge at his last appointment that I'm like, he's probably 11 pounds by now, honestly. We've been having to put him in size two diapers at night. He is three weeks old right now, three weeks and like a couple days. And we've been having to put size two diapers on him because if we don't, then he leaks pee everywhere. So. He pretty much completely skipped newborn diapers. I thought he was going to be in size one for a little while, but no. He has a size two on him right now, actually. Because I knew we were going to be out and about, and so I didn't want him to, like, leak and have that kind of disaster going on, so. I actually feel pretty refreshed today because Miles actually slept so good last night. I nursed him before bed, and then he woke up at, like, two something in the morning and then he didn't wake up again until like 6 45 and then I just kind of stayed up for the day because we knew we wanted to leave the house pretty early because we wanted to do all the shopping that we wanted to do before his doctor's appointment and so we knew we were going to be on like um, a time crunch so we wanted to get an early start but he did so good because he's been recently I think he's been like I don't know if he's been cluster feeding or what it is but he really has been waking up a whole bunch in the middle of the night like every two hours or less and so i'm just swapping back and forth just right boob left boob right boob left boob like literally all night and i'm like oh my goodness but last night was so nice what kind of game track or treasure treasure tracker yeah i've never heard of that it's a toad game it's a toad game yeah oh okay sounds fun. I have it right here in the bag. I'm gonna just look at it and see. Oh, that looks cute. Did he pick that out completely himself or did you persuade him to get this one? He said, can you pick for me? I said, I'm not gonna pick for you. I said, but I can help you. Huh. I started naming off games I thought he would play and he said, yeah, that, that one right there. Liam's just back here with like the paper towels and everything. Do you like the game? Yeah. Yeah, it's fun. Toad's face is so weird. <laughs> I'm oh my goodness. He's gonna be stuck in this game for days and days. Every time he gets a new game, it's just like serious to him he I will... get back up i can't jump in the game. <laughs> uh so you can't I... jump in it no oh so i got to reset the game that makes it trickier for sure yeah because i got to the bridge falls off because it has a crack on it oh okay so i got to not go on the bridge okay 
We also got some cookies while we were in the mall. We usually get cookies every time we go into the mall. And they actually had my favorite one, which is this one right here on the end. It's called Domino. I think it's like supposed to be like cookies and cream type of cookie. I don't know. We got red velvet. Oh, one of Josh's is broken. He got like four snickerdoodle. He's obsessed with snickerdoodle cookies. But I'm so excited because I've been having a major sweet tooth lately. I already ate one of my cookies actually. <laughs> Josh is making me drive now. He drove here, so he wants me to drive home, but I'm all like jacked up on my coffee. I've been talking his head off, and I'm like, you shouldn't have bought me coffee. I'm sorry, you have yourself to blame. That's it, just. <laughs> Wherever you're going, I'm going to. I'll follow you through the black and the blue. Well, he's nursing again. Um, but we're waiting on the doctor to come in, but they weighed him and he's 11 pounds and two ounces, which I knew it. I knew he had hit 11 pounds. I just had a feeling and he's 22 and a half inches long. So he's an inch longer than he was when he was born. So he's getting so big. I'm trying not to like show myself, but he's getting so big so fast. And he's currently mad at me because he's undressed and he hates not having his clothes on. <laughs> Look, he's a little piggy. <laughs> I'm sorry. Here's this size two diaper I was talking about. <laughs> it looks a little big, but not like too crazy, which the bag says that these diapers are for 12 pounds to 18 pounds, which I don't know if I said that already, but so he's not like way too small for them or anything. So how are we doing with the feetings? He's doing good. Good. You feel like your milk's in good? Oh yeah. Good. Gosh, he's filled out so much. He looks like a different baby. Did you see his weight yet? I'm clicking over there now. I must be going to be, oh my gosh, yeah. A pound and six ounces, a pound and four ounces in two weeks. That's very good, 20 ounces in that. Oh, I'm so proud. I know you feel better. What was his birth weight? Nine one. Oh, so awesome. he's got, he gained over, what, two pounds? Yeah, that's he was very born. good. That's crazy. Yeah, so good. Mm -hmm. I think we're just close enough we can count this as his one month as good as he's doing. <laughs> and we'll see him back at two months. But now if you feel like is. we need to see him, we will. I just pulled up back at the house. We were in such a rush. Look at this. We've got paper towels back here. We've got like all of our stuff still in here from Sam's Club and all of our shopping that we did because I had to literally drop them off at the house and then me and Miles go to his appointment. So also look at how mad he looks. Oh, he moved it. He had his whole hand. He just had his head over and he just had his whole hand on his face like this. Like he just looked like over, over it for the day. I wanted to show you guys um, real quick. We got, we finally got, I should say, Miles, his baby book. We hadn't gotten him one yet because there's a Christian bookstore that's like a little bit, I don't know, like 45 minutes or something away. Maybe like 30, 35 minutes away. Anyway, I don't know. There's a Christian bookstore that we got Liam's uh, baby book from and we weren't sure. They only had one, or not Liam's. Oh my goodness. I have too many kids now. We got Bryce's baby book from there and that's the only baby book they had so we didn't know if they had any different ones now and luckily they did. They had the kind we got for Bryce and then they had this one and this is just like the box that it's in. I'm gonna pull it out and just kind of like show you it real quick because it's so cute. So we finally have a baby book. We have stuff that we've got already that we need to stick in here, but it's so cute. It has like a little thing here to put little keepsakes in. I don't know, here's a random page, but it's super cute. I really, really like it. I'm really happy with it. I'm so excited because we have like our hospital um, bracelets and like ultrasound pictures that I wanna put in here and stuff like that. I'm honestly waiting on Josh to get here. He grabbed some food because we're actually gonna be going grocery shopping tomorrow, or no, not grocery shopping. We're gonna do a grocery pickup order tomorrow. And so we have like no food in the house. And so he was out with Bryce and Liam so he just like grabbed some food so I'm killing time I'll show you we got these shirts from JCPenney and they were like all like $7.99 a piece I think for Liam we just got him like some sporty type of shirt so this says less flex more focus this one says game face every day this one's just a random one that we got for Bryce. Be kind, be cool, be you. Then this one is just a baseball. Wait. Yep, baseball shirt. This one says no no excuses, no limits. I really like this one, but I love like gray and neutral colors and stuff. And this is just like a football little shirt. 
So now he has five new shirts to get started for school, which we did do a clothing shopping trip, not really trip. We got him some stuff off of the children's place online and then a couple things from JCPenney. Over the summer, and it's stuff that he hasn't really worn out yet or anything, like he does have quite a few new shirts anyways, but Josh did want to get him at least like five like brand new shirts that he's never wore that he's not going to wear until he starts school. So, I'm really excited about that. We do just have to get him some new shorts because a lot of his shorts are pretty worn out because he's a boy so he needs some like new shorts probably jeans too for school also it's only been a few hours and liam's been playing his switch light and josh said he already beat this game so there's that i gotta get my baby in the house because he's probably so tired of being in his car seat today it's not even funny well, we came home to this sitting on the porch i'm not really sure what all is in it i'm sure there's some little samples of formula and it says like coupons, but that's kind of nice. Okay, so I didn't expect there to be three cans of formula in here. It came with like three different ones. I don't know what else. The house sounds like chaos in the background right now. That's good though, because if we ever needed to use it, we wouldn't know what kind would work on him. So there's pro sensitive, pro advanced, and pro total comfort. So different ones to try. So that's pretty cool. I don't know if this is something that was just like automatically sent out like from something that we filled out at the hospital or what because I have no idea where this came from. Not gonna lie, it feels pretty good to be home since we were out all day. I was looking forward to today because I really wanted to get out of the house because I've been in the house a lot and I know in the past like two vlogs I have gotten out of the house so it looks like I've been leaving the house a lot but those are the only times I've actually left the house. I've just decided to vlog those days so it wouldn't be quite as boring of a vlog because I wasn't just like sitting at home all day but those are pretty much the only times that I've actually gotten out of the house is the vlogs that you guys have seen so I was looking forward to it but it was a lot and it was a busy day so it made me actually look forward to coming home so I guess I got it out of my system I've gotten all comfortable I put on my little nursing gown I have like three gowns that are nursing friendly but I feel like I need more and Bryce not Bryce Miles already had a little hi Miles already had a blowout on the front of one of mine. I didn't even know the stain was there until Josh pointed it out. I had been wearing the gown like all day and Josh was like, what's on you? And it was a huge blowout. And I had, I'm pretty sure it had been on there since before the last time I washed it. So it's like a stain. So I'm really bummed out because it's one I just bought. This one I had with Bryce. Were you going to stop recording? What are you doing? He's trying to take a picture. Oh, you did it. Good job. Look. But yeah, I, I need to get more because three, like, we get milk on, and milk gets on it and like he spits up on them and stuff. Like I'll change multiple times a day, more than, more than I even change Miles, which is really weird. I haven't had to change Miles' clothes as much as I remember having to change like Liam and Bryce's clothes when they were newborns. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but like in my vlogs, he'll be in the same onesie like usually in a lot of my vlogs, like the whole day. Bryce is being buck wild. Bryce! Hello. Hi. Say hi. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Can you say Miles? <laughs> Look, it's you. It's Bryce. Blanket. Yeah, your blanket's in the, in the screen too. I feel a lot better about his hair now, by the way. We started putting some of Josh's hair product in his hair and brushing it over, and it's been staying in place most of the day. What am I doing with my hands? And um, it looks a whole lot better like that, so I think I can deal with it. Anyways, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog out here. I feel like this vlog has been like a whole bunch of me talking and like hardly any like clips of the kids or montages or anything like that. It just kind of like ended up that way because today was so busy. But I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, please consider subscribing and we'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.